Uh, no, I asked on social media if anyone could submit questions that they would like me to answer on the stage. And these are the questions for people that come. Uh, all right, hang on. Carol. Carol, 1970. That's over again. Are you going to Pesh Mode? <laughs> I've got a feeling this is going to go really bad. <laughs> Carol says, Hiya, Tom. Would you mind wishing, wishing Sharon a happy birthday at the gig, please? Happy so birthday, question. Sharon! I feel like Steve Wright doing his Radio 2 show or something. I'm taking requests. All right. Um, <laughs> Garmin Willem Will Dave, how do I pronounce that word? Gar Garmin? Oh, I can't do it. Hey, <laughs> Garmin Willem. Is that how you say it? Willem? Yeah. Willem is. is that you out there somewhere? Do you, Tom, do you have absolute or perfect pitch? No. <laughs> <laughs> I'm asking, is there a certain song like Quicksand where you come in before or at the same time as the band? Well, that's what these beauties were invented for. <laughs> I've got all sorts of things going on. All sorts of instructions. Go this way. Go that way. Sing this bit. Uh, no, but I could just, I could hear the note before it begins. Um, yeah. But I have actually, funnily enough, it does make me think of times when, often as a singer, you might be in a certain type of room or a certain venue, and these things kind of, they don't really work very well, and you end up not really being able to hear the pitch of a song. And it's like, uh, for, for a, very, it's very disarming, because for a whole song you can just not know the tune or the key of the song at all. And it's a bit like what it must be like for anyone out there who's tone deaf. <laughs> Which, <laughs> judging by some of the videos you send in, of you guys singing along to the song. Ow! Yeah? Yeah, you are right. Sorry? I, I can hear you, yes. <laughs> Are you asking a question? Nah. No, don't worry about it. Let's move on. <laughs> All right, Jonathan Davis. Jo that's a very much name. Jonathan, you're there. Right, he says, Hi, TC. I'm taking my daughter, Macy, to see you in Cardiff. Front row. There we are, front row. Oh, yeah. She's beside herself with excitement. Is that oh. true? <laughs> She's not in the book. She has her driving test on the morning of the show, so we're hoping it's a night of celebration, right? Oh no! Is it a night of celebration? Yeah! 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 Woo! Woo! Yes! Well done, Macy. Was that the first time? I'm assuming. No, no, it's first time. It's first time. Uh, well done. Um, Nick, right, I'm going to get these over and done with. Um, Nicole Kemper says, Hi Tom, don't you ever get tired of singing Somewhere Only We Know over and over again? No! Sounds like Nicole's tired of singing it, the way she's afraid of it. No! Do I get tired of it? Um, no! Yeah, I no! No, I don't get tired, of course I don't get tired of it. And it's a song that keeps taking on a new life, you know, it's now kind of a TikTok gig in, in Asia. God, I sound like an old... Twice, uh, you guys know it's a TikTok hit. Uh, I don't personally have a TikTok account. Anyway, so, um, I should have a TikTok account. Yeah, okay. Would you advise me on that? Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, okay. I find Instagram hard enough, but anyway. Um, but no, I mean, somebody we know, you know, it's, it's gone all right, isn't it? So, uh, I'm still slightly ill. Um, Alison Tucker, hello Tom, how are you doing? Um, I'm doing all right, I think. <laughs> uh, my question to you is, would you like to live forever? Oh. Is that, yeah, is that a wish you can grant me? <laughs> if so, what are some, some of the things you would like to do? Oh God. 
Uh, I wouldn't like to live forever. I think that would be horrendous. Um, write more songs. Write more songs. There we are. That's... <laughs> Oh my. Oh God. I've limped to the end of the question. <laughs> so the other thing that I did ask on social media was um, to, for you guys to submit uh, some a keen, you know, ideas for a keen rarity that you haven't heard for a very long time. 